Guys, this is my childhood boat. This is my parents' Alumacraft Tournament Pro. In today's video, we are giving it a massive facelift. You're gonna to wanna to watch till the end, to see how this turns out. What's going on, Scott? Watch the side cab. Let me tell you, you got it stuck. Again. Again? No, we're here getting uh, Jay's parents' boat. A little revamp. A little revamp, but uh, you know, we might be forced in spring. <laughs> Look how deep this is. There's the old Tourney Pro, and she is covered in some snow. And this is what I started chipping out here. It's rock hard, all on this path. We got Matei shoveling. Welcome to Canada. So something about this boat, while the guys are working hard to get unstuck there, is it is a carpet boat, and I said you have to remove the carpet. Well, Aqua Traction has been developing their own proprietary system for putting the Aqua Traction over the carpet. I can't go into detail of it. You got a loose lug nut. I can't go into detail, he just said he's got a loose lug nut, into what exactly we're gonna do. I mean, the first part is just getting it out of here. <laughs> oh! Did you get out? Yeah. Well, we were unstuck. Yeah. We're gonna have to dig. Yeah, I guess you're okay. I don't know if the camera captured that or not. Well, that was fun. Ah. Dave saved the day, number two. He just pulls me out of all the situations I get myself in. Father-in-law Dave. Look at that. That was easy. All right, we're at the home of Aqua Traction, the shop where all the magic happens. Obviously we can scan and install in different locations, but this is where a lot of the bigger projects are gonna go on. And we have a lot of boats in the shop right now. It is an exciting time. Matei, our lead installer scanner, is working hard right now. We're gonna go check on what's happening. And we got my parents' boat in there, the one that you remember that we pulled out of the snow. And we might be ripping some carpet today and planning what carpet isn't gonna get ripped out because we're going inside. So we got, yeah, three boats in the shop right now. Big thing. This is Jamie Wall's boat. Uh, Jamie's son actually helped us at the outpost this summer. This boat has been through so much. I it's gonna look unreal. To get it all done. Yeah. So this is my parents' boat. Um, what do you think? Do you think? But like the ones where it's like, like that's not even stuck under there. Yeah, I just wonder about the gaps and stuff then. We were back at Lake of the Woods Marina with Matei. And a little update on my parents' boat on this extreme boat makeover, Alumacraft edition. It's not looking too hot right now, but they always say it's darkest before the dawn. But right now we peeled the carpet off the side. Um, that was the easiest. There's aluminum underneath, so that'll install very nice. Matei scanned, the gunnels are ready. This is gonna be sweet. Just picture, like his, this is the uh, an older Tournament Pro. I stand and fish on these a lot of the time. It'll be so nice, stand and fishing barefoot. I think we might put maybe a measuring tape on the side here, or maybe a Catch and Cook logo. I'm thinking a big Aqua Traction logo. So on the floor here, we peel the carpet off because there's no latches, it's a little bit easier to deal with. So we just peeled the carpet off. Matei kind of puttied in some of the wood, sanded it a bit. That's pretty much ready to go. The carpet, we got a little special process going on that uh, we are under a strict NDA that we cannot share. We're gonna scan that as well. And then pretty much the process is Matei will scan the boat. He'll edit it together. There's some editing work, goes to HQ. Then we play with the design. I wanna do something pretty creative. So we'll, we'll see what we end up doing. It. Anyways, yeah. Okay, I think I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna scan it with these in there, right? Oh yeah, because that's, that's what we want it to look like. Yeah. We're starting to scan. Well, Matei is 
good at what he does. I have learned how to scan. I've done a little bit, but probably the best for everyone if I'm not the scanner here. Well, we bought that boat at Alumacraft from an auction in the States by we, I mean my parents. I don't even know, in 2007? I don't know, we've had that boat for, for quite a while, so this is gonna be a huge facelift to it. I'm excited. All right, we are back. Today's install day. I don't know if we'll get it all installed, but my parents' boat, this has been a long project, pretty much because we've been working on customers' boats first. Anyways, we're back and my parents need their boat done because I've been kind of dragging my feet on it. So anyways, we are scraping off the gunnels. We finished the process on the carpet. So this is our first boat, as we mentioned, that we're doing aqua traction over carpet. And hopefully we get most of the floor installed today. We got a lot of work to do still. So. All right, well, we got the gunnels done, partially done. We're gonna put some primer on here and then we can start doing pads. There's light at the end of the tunnel. I am an artist. I am an artist. Hannon, I'm an artist. Hannon, hey! All right, Hannon is gonna put the first piece of aqua traction. Oh, that's got stickiness. First piece of aqua traction down. Okay, it's good. All done. Some of the crunch, baby! Catch a cookbook. This is, yeah, sir, I haven't been giving you guys many updates. This is so exciting because there's so much prep, so much lead up. Matei did an amazing amount of the prep. And if you book a boat with Aqua Traction of Central Canada, you're likely dealing with Matei, he's a master. In the aqua traction insert inlay. Inlay will do that. Oh wow, what? that's like perfect. All right, well this is the final reveal, but it's pretty pretty close. We gotta take off and one more one more session. Thanks to Matei and Mason for helping out and Hannah. This is it. This is the final unveiling of my parents' Alumacraft and it is looking sharp. Yeah, we're gonna give you the run through of what we actually put in here. Uh, this is called the teak pattern. It has breathed so much life into this boat. This boat, my parents were like, well, should we get rid of it? I'm like, no, let's get some new flooring, get a new trolling motor. Like the boat doesn't leak, it'll be like new. We ripped the carpet out on the bottom. We kept the carpet on the front. We ripped the carpet off on the sides, scanned it. And here we have the aqua traction. So I'll give you the walkthrough starting right beside me. So this is all custom scanned, as you know, 
around the cleats, around the antenna. We can add whatever we want. So we added a 60 inch measuring tape. You might say, Jay, that's kind of sketchy having a measuring tape on the side of the boat. I would agree with that, but I wanted the 60 inch tape and there was nowhere else I could do a 60 inch tape with how the boat lays out. So we got the Alumacraft, the new Alumacraft lo logo. This is laser cut, just a nice shallow logo there. We've got the big A, the uh, Aqua Traction A. This is an inset logo. We've got all custom cut around the drains, around the seat pedestals, going up to the front. This, this is where there's one thing I would do different. Since this is our first boat doing carpet, we left a little bigger of a gap here. We could have made it tighter. So next time I would have a, a tighter tolerance. If you were ripped the carpet out on the front, then you'd have big gaps there. So now it's still, you know, butts up against each other, keeps that waterproofing. But the other option is you could get completely new, new doors. There's a company called Aftec that does fiberglass doors. We decided to do over the carpet this time. So I, I'm super impressed. The other thing with the process we did to this carpet, it makes them rock hard. So now these compartments that were soft before, now they're solid. So that's another plus. What else we got? We got the big old pocketed catch and cook logo in the front. This is awesome. I told my parents, I said, if we're outfitting your boat, we're gonna slide a little catch and cook marketing in there. Custom cut around the GPS puck, custom cut around the light, put the trolling motor over top of the aqua traction. And then going around here, we got the big old sum in the crunch. That's the catch and cook slogan. This is so comfy. So it's called closed cell XPE foam, very stain resistant. I've had lots of blood and gas and spilt all sorts of stuff on it. You give it a pressure wash, a little soap, pressure wash it again. It looks brand new. So this boat has already been used for a couple months. I cleaned it up for this uh, unveiling, but my parents are very happy. The next thing I think I want to do is a boat wrap on the outside because I feel like the interior is so nice now. We need to upgrade the outside. But anyways, good way to breathe life into a boat. Yeah, we're going to do a little fishing. Yeah, thanks for following along. A little bit of a different video. But hey, if you're looking for some aqua traction, give our boy Matea a call. He's doing the scanning, the installing. You can have a boat just like this.